everybody, it's me again, and welcome to episode number 29, holy crap, of Syndicate Shenanigans. We're here in World War I London, playing as Lydia Fry, and we only have two things left to do in World War I. We have one more viewpoint, and we have this hideout thing called Hopton's, which we're going to go ahead and liberate in a second, but let's go ahead and read about it first. A pub with a reputation for violence and attracting a clientele of criminals and lowlifes, Hopton's has long been considered a lost cause by the local police. It has, however, become much quieter in recent months, and shadowy figures are said to congregate in the building's upper floors. That's creepy. And very intriguing. Let's go ahead and investigate! So, oh my goodness, that building is on fire. Whoa. That's unfortunate. Poor Jay Vaughn and his royal whiskey. And Taylor and Wheels' artificial teeth. Oh no, whatever shall they do? Can I thank you, Lydia? God damn it, I keep almost calling you Evie. Hi. Plant false information and steal three documents. Okay, so this is the same one as last time. Holy mackerel. There's two there. Where's number three? Oh, right below me. Okay. Uh. And you know what? Let me see one more thing. What's this? Is there another Zeppelin raid? Yeah, okay. I've already done that twice, actually. So, we won't do that. I'm hoping this will get me to level 1 when I beat this. Because if it doesn't, then I'm going to miss out on that achievement, and then I'm going to be upset. So, let's see. Best way to do this... I think it would be wisest to go in here first. <laughs> Ah, poop on a stick. Well, I wanted to kill the other guy, but whatever. You both can die. Yay, undetected! Hooray. Okay, looting. There. That's one down. Plant false information. Where am I supposed to do that at? This isn't exactly what I wanted for myself. Get back up. Okay, hold on. Uh, let's steal from you first. That window is open, so yay. Damn it! I didn't want you to jump all the way down, Lydia. I only have one smoke bomb left. That's probably a problem. There's also a lot of people in here. Oh, the spy turned around! God damn it! Fuck you! Yeah! There! Document numero dos. Come up here to investigate our dirt, ya. Huh? What's going on? Oh my, there's a whole brouhaha going on down there. Alrighty then. Hold on, let me just go ahead and disable this. <laughs> For some reason. Okay. They're still down one floor, my goodness. You! Do you have plans I need to plant? Oh wait, they're on the table. That's it. Okay, I can plant this. So precise. What the heck did I even plant? A microchip? Whatever. Game logic. Okay. Oh, she's dead. Okay, well somebody killed her. It wasn't me. I was gonna lure her out and kill her myself, but whatever. There we go. This is what I want. Done! And I've planted the false information, so out we go! And I die! Yay! There we go! Please level one, level one, level one, level one! Hey! Achievement! Achievement! Maybe? Potentially? Oh, again, huh? Well, okay then. Here we go again! Okay. I intend to build, to transform your age into something greater than you can currently comprehend. With us as slaves, no thanks. That's it? That's it? That's all she says to me? Hey, Is that my level one? There it is! Okay. It was a little late there, I was a little worried. But there we go. Okay, I did it! 
Now all I have left is the viewpoint. Spy leader, the master spy. What a name. Like to see that guy get called in attendance at school. <laughs> Henry, here. Violet, here. The master spy, <laughs> here. Oh boy. I need to stop trying to make jokes. All right, this is it, guys. We have just one viewpoint, and then we're done in World War One. That rhymes. Fuck, I'm good. Here we go. Final viewpoint. Let's go up. There we go. I love that view so much. Our final viewpoint in Assassin's Creed Syndicate, ladies and gentlemen. This is it. Our very last viewpoint for a very long time, I would say. And there it is. Aw, that's always so sad. Wait, I have one more thing left. What is that? What is that? I've never seen that thing before. What? Oh, I guess we're not done yet. Okay, we're not done. We have a master spy to take out. Interesting. What is this, like a gang war? I have no idea, but I'm nervous. I don't know what this is. Oh god, my head is just so bad. Okay. Whoa, watch it, Amy. Lydia, fuck. I'm oh, sorry. Alright, let's see what the hell is going on here. The master spy. Do I have skills? Nah, they're just the same as Jacob and Evie's, and I'm fully upgraded as it is. Okay. That's fine. Alrighty. Hello, Mr. Churchill. And hi, everybody else. Last known location above a carpenter's shop. Miss Fry has uncovered the location of the sinister cult of spies plaguing our streets. Otherwise known as the Templars. Follow her lead and let us rid London of this menace. Alright. Huzzah! Huzzah! Infiltrate the spy HQ. Where is it? It's back where I came from, of course. All right, here we go. Oh! Oh, watch the boat! Jesus! It looked like I was heading right for it. All right, we're almost there. The spy H HQ. Excuse me, I am in Britain after all. Is up there somewhere. Whoa! How do I get in? Does that bookcase move? All right, I can get in through this window. On me. I am no peasant. I may play on console and prefer it, but I am no peasant! Here we go. Oh, sir! I already- it's, it's in a book- it's in a bookcase. Well, that's a bit of an issue. Papers, huh? The bodies. They're just kind of talking randomly until I move this thing. Yeah, I've heard this already many times. A crazy glint in his eyes, like he's seen God. That's weird. Hello! Did I come at a bad time? Fucking try me! Damn it, I wanted it to be a double kill. Why does it give me sometimes and not the other times? That's stupid. Your beloved, huh? Who would that be? Find me! Whoa! Whoa! He just dove out the fucking window! That was crazy! Beloved. Wait a minute! Beloved? Who will guide you into the gray? Hello! I don't think so. Not on my watch. Shut up. Beloved. Ooh, that's creepy! Oh my goodness! 
crazy glint in his eyes. How much you wanna bet they ain't the same color. And I'm out! I did it. Okay, he's dead. Excellent Cutscene. work. The ringleader is dead, as are his bizarre disciples. Wait! Is that wasn't dead? Templars! That was, um... The war on. Fuck! What are they called? We both have our own affairs to return to. Know that you have done a great service to your country. All oh, believe Thank me. You. You're welcome, Mr. Churchill. It's weird seeing you so young, but... Hey, there we go! So... That wasn't the Templars they were talking about, were they? That was the, um... What are they called? The people obsessed with the first civilization, the ones that want to free Juno. I forget what they're called. That was really cool, though. So, okay, here we go again. What are they called? I'm forgetting- P put it down in the comments, please, I forget. Hi. The man the Emperor killed was my husband, Aita. I thought so. Known in your time as a sage. Thank you for discovering his fate. Don't his worry about it. Will be added to my own. Perhaps you believe, as other assassins before you, that it is your duty to work against me. But consider this. It was an assassin who freed me from my prison. I am no longer she who lies in wait. I am the mother of wisdom. Oh, dear. I am the nexus of flesh and machine. I am Juno. I've known that for a while, thank you. And if the greatest assassin of your generation can see things my way, then perhaps you can too. The greatest assassin of my gen- Galena? Nope. Is she talking about Galena? Nope. His pattern will be added to my own? Why did she want to discover his fate? Why that guy? His pattern will be added to my own. Is she trying to figure out who the new sage is? Is she trying to track who died when and track the whole reincarnation rebirth process so she can find out who currently is her husband? Which would be that little boy we read about, listened about in that in that assassin intel in the main game? Is that is that is that, is that what's going on here? Oh, that's so exciting. <gasps> okay. It was an assassin who freed me from my prison. He's, she, she's talking about Desmond, obviously. He sacrificed himself. But it was only to keep... It was only because it was better than the alternative. Which was basically just starting the cycle all over again and ending up in the exact same spot in a couple thousand years. So, yeah. He didn't want you freed for the sake of your freedom. He wanted you freed so we could stop you. But still, that's- oh, that's so crazy cool. That is so cool, but okay, that's the World War I simulation done. And, uh, I can do one more thing back in the main game. So let's go ahead and go back. So that was the World War I simulation, guys. I did absolutely everything except the collectibles on camera. All the missions and everything. It is done. And that was a very intriguing ending. <gasps> oh, that's so exciting! Those could all be hints! They're all connecting now. As I'm getting to the last stuff, they're all connecting. That young boy they found back in 2015, who is supposed to be a sage, that had sages throughout all the eras we've already visited, even though we've never seen them. And I think that's what Juno was doing. She wanted us to follow Lydia Fry so she could find who was a sage before John Standish? Maybe? So like, it was that guy and then, who was also a Templar, which is discouraging. And then there's John, and then this kid, this little boy. Oh, That's gonna be so exciting! We have so much present day stuff that's like coming up in the next game. Oh, that's gonna be so amazing, and I'm so excited. Ah! Ah! Okay, but back to the main game. Let's see. What's something quick we can do? Uh, I have a lot of Darwin missions left to do. So let's go ahead and do this one. Defamation, the nearest fast travel point being St. Paul's is a little closer. So let's go. Let's go visit Charles Darwin. 
Okay, it's just down that alley behind me, so we can go ahead and stop here. You know, I wonder... How many achievements do I have left in this game? It's not much. I know that. Um, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Oh! I got the ball! That was my last one! Oh! I got that on camera! Oh, that's so exciting! The World War One simulation achievement was my last one! I've gotten all achievements in Assassin's Creed Syndicate! Oh! Woohoo! High five, guys! Bam! We did it! We did it together! Oh! Oh, that's awesome! I was wondering how many I had left, but that's it! Now all I gotta worry about is getting that 100% full sync mark. Hello, Mr. Darwin! Defamation? Sounds dramatic. Be a deer and fetch- Well, that seems strangely not correct, but- My young friend. Today's papers carry a rebuttal of Mr. Owen's slanderous and ignorant remarks about my work. I bet you're happy about that, right? However, I'm feeling quite like a fossil today. Would you be a dear and get me a copy of the newspaper? Sure. This seems oddly unnecessary. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Hey, you! What happened? What did you do that for? He also runs very- I hate the chase missions where they like pick up speed as soon as you start to get close. It fucking sucks! You dick! Get back here! Well, nothing. Fuck off. I'm doing something important. Whoa, 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 whoa! Jesus Christ! What the hell happened there? I have no idea. I thought that was a blighter carriage trying to run me over, but nope, it was just some deranged, inebriated driver, apparently. Oh my god, come here! Slow down! I'm chasing this guy all the way across freaking London. How did I lose him precisely? Oh my god, I don't even know what's happening anymore, but... Oh god! I'm chasing this guy halfway across the whole freaking city! Fuck! Because he pushed a news vendor! Like, my god! What is this, an offense punishable by death? Why is this guy so important? Besides the fact that he's a blighter, and therefore one in like 10,000, there's lifts in this game? That seems oddly unnecessary, thanks to the rope launcher. Oh my god! Can a train fucking run this guy over? Just <laughs> end it already! Come on! You're stuck. Oh, well, maybe I spoke a little too soon. No! Oh, that was close. Fuck you. You saved my life. No more pushing newspaper yes. vendors. Now, here's a question for you Why would you attack a newsboy? A man paid me and my mates to force newsboys to display this leaflet. Yeah, take the bloody thing and leave me alone. This spells trouble for Mr. Darwin. What does the leaflet say? Cruel caricature. Track down the source of the anti-Darwin propaganda. Oh. Oh, really? That is cruel. That's mean. Well, all right then. That took a very exciting turn all of a sudden. <laughs> Defamation, that sounds quite scary and serious. <laughs> Fetch Darwin a newspaper. What? Okay. All right, well, that's all we'll do for this episode of Syndicate Shenanigans. So I hope you guys are enjoying. Like and favorite if you are. Subscribe if you want to see more. And I will see you in my next video. Farewell, friends. Get the fuck out of my face! Shut the fuck up. I just saved your life. I can do whatever the hell I want to you.